Welcome to the iPad app first look and this is a nice little utility that's very nice for any iPad or iPhone it's the AccuWeather now this is the AccuWeather HD which is for the iPad you also have regular AccuWeather for iPod touch and iPhone AccuWeather being what it says a nice little weather app that you just turn on so I'll we'll click on it here is free of charge on the App Store which is very nice and basically it's uh, from the AccuWeather.com site what is nice about the AccuWeather app is that uh, unfortunately most of the apps that I've seen for iPad, iPod don't actually have uh, all the uh, world areas and lots of people are actually kind of you know put off by the fact that unfortunately there isn't any real weather app for their own uh, area and AccuWeather.com actually plugs into databases of other weather um, I would say other weather uh, companies and uh, local weather of governments and actually puts all that in one big app so all you have to do is when you actually per turn it on for the first time you'll be asked if you want to use the uh, geo -lo -local 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 localization sorry look a look a lie look a look a lie so uh, <laughs> you'll have uh, it will ask you to pinpoint where you are and so you'll be able to actually uh, have your weather uh, pretty close and actually it's really accurate and very close because uh, Saint Michel is actually a district of uh, Montreal <clears throat> and I'm uh, actually very close to Saint Michel so that is very 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 nice because it means it's really really the closest point to my own uh, weather can be in metric form uh, you have all the options here you get the what's currently uh, the weather you can have the forecast and see what we will have as a forecast you will also have uh, maps so if you want to have uh, a radar map showing you where it's uh, snowy or rainy or whatever uh, it's really nice and you've got also some uh, news feeds about uh, what's happening in the weather you have videos that uh, will give you a international feel if you're in, in, in another country or if you're United States you'll have also local US weather so it's a really really nice app I mean it, I believe that of all the weather apps available this is one of the best even for hurricanes so uh, pretty cool settings uh, you have the imperial or metric with temperature and wind and also the uh, type of uh, display you want uh, classic black or vintage and uh, you can have calendar notification show up here so it's a very beautiful app I think this is one of the best weather app actually out there for the iPad and uh, and iPhone especially if in your area there is no app that actually shows the weather where you are and that is really nice about AccuWeather is the fact that it's available almost anywhere and that's a good 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 uh, app for that here in Canada we have a local app which is um, the Weather Channel app which is very good also but um, I must say I even find this one kind of better than the uh, regular weather channel app we have here so AccuWeather for iPad, iPod Touch and iPhone very very beautiful app for weather and especially if you aren't able to find any weather app that displays weather for your area of the world this is a great app it probably will have weather for you so it's free of charge which is really nice and available on the App Store so go and uh, install this uh, nice weather app if you uh, want to have more uh, information about local weather. 
So if you enjoy these uh, videos, uh, looks at apps, uh, click the subscribe button at the top of the screen. You'll be informed when new videos are online. And if you have any comments or questions, let us know. And uh, any requests of app reviews you'd like to see, let us know. We'll try to do something about that. So thanks for watching and hope you come back to the iPad Apps First Look channel. Bye-bye.